Well, good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. So red and white, of course, the preeminent colours at Old Trafford, which is now officially the largest club football ground in England. Its capacity, 75,000 and growing. Two high-profile, high-calibre teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. And we're underway. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Henrik Mkhitaryan. He's not the biggest, strongest or quickest, Peter, but what he lacks in physique, he certainly makes up for with a supreme footballing intelligence and, and great technique. He just seems to be able to see situations develop before anybody else, and he usually tends to pick the right option, too. OK, interesting. Fred, and it's Shaw. Karstorp, Pellegrini, Cristante, Smalling, Smalling plays it forward, Roma get it back again, Dzeko plays it out to the wing, Mkhitaryan, McTominay demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. And here's Cavani. And it's played forward. And here's Jekko. It's on a plate. Oh, great defending. That needed doing. Mkhitaryan really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. It's Pogba! Just off target. Well, he doesn't need a second invitation, even from that range. Hoists it forward. There too. Mukatarian. It is deadlocked. Mukatarian. There too. He's looked long this time. That intervention was very necessary. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Maguire. Bruno Fernandes. Pogba. Shaw. Shaw plays it backwards and they'll try again. Rashford tries to head towards goal. And the keeper's in command. Lindelof. Cavani gets into a dangerous position. And here's Dzeko. Just brushed off the ball there. 
Oh, he's caught him there. It's a free kick. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. We all love a trier, Peter, but the wiser choice would have been ball into box. Pogba. Bruno Fernandes. Karstorp. And there is the half-time whistle. So neither team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. How's the first half? And the second half gets underway. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. That's the throw. And it's Mkhitaryan. Dzeko has a go! He's delivered all right! Well, when one or two others were maybe a tad slow at restarting this game, then up steps a big character who was simply switched on and bright, and he sparked another advantage for his team at an important stage. It augurs well. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Roma take the lead, 1-0. Oh, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. McTominay. One Bissaka. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Lindelof goes looking out to the right. He's got it on the right now. What's on? Rashford with the cross. Karstorp. Dzeko. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Manchester United have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. McTominay. Rashford. And here's Cavani. Can't get the better of his opposite number. It's a loose ball. Mkhitaryan has got himself a free kick. And it's Cavani. <laughs> McTominay plays a clever pass. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Final checks on the touchline. 
a change about to occur. Substitution in progress. Fred. Maguire. McTominay goes upfield. Out to the left it goes. Spinazzola has created one goal already. El Sharawi. Roma have made a great start to the second half, and it's 1 0. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Decent hit and on target. Bye. And it's Rashford. Bruno Fernandes. Into the box. And he's there to cut it out. Manchester United need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Now it's Dzeko. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. El Sharawi. Pogba. Keeps everyone guessing. Needs a quality cross. Whistle's gone, and they've got themselves a free kick. Now, this is a potential flashpoint, and the referee has his hands full. by the keeper, he's read that well. And the referee brings it to a close. Terrific contest, it really might have tipped either way. The margins were tiny, just a goal in it, but that was enough. Yeah, it was never a match that was going to blow us all away, Peter. But...